Representative Rogers, in debate. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Thank you, members. This is an awesome day in the House of Representatives because I could tell you last year, it was my privilege with that of Representative Reggie Fulward to co-sponsor and carry this part of the legislation that speaks to U.S. born children of undocumented parents who were denied the right to access in-state tuition rate. And I want you to know it took a court order for us to gain that rights for those children. So this has been codified into law and we are so pleased that it even went beyond that. So I just want to join with uh, Representative Nunez in saying thank you to every member that will vote for this bill this morning. We are doing the right thing by our U.S. born citizens' children who can go to war and fight for this country and protect this country, who are able to do everything else but access that dream of higher education because we have already invested in these children from K through 12th grade. They are mandated that they must go to school. So there are. This is a return on your investment by allowing them to go on to college at the lower rate. So members, I ask you and encourage you to join us in voting for this bill. And yes, we are immigrants. I came to this country at the age of 16. I'm proud to be a US citizen, and I know my colleague to my right, Representative Daphne Campbell, who will speak as a Haitian American citizen of this country and my other fellow Caribbean here. 69% of the immigrant population here in Florida are from Caribbean descent. So we are proud to be Americans, and I stand proud today asking you to vote in support of U.S. citizens who are doing great things in our country. I thank you.